There's some evidence that shows otherwise. Oh, yeah, it was her. Yeah, I'm, a, I'm a good jumper, bruv. No, I'm not bad. Like, swish! Are you good at basketball? Oh, I just played basketball. Oh, I don't want to say, do you know what I mean? I want to be that guy. Of course I can play basketball. I ain't that good though. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, there's a remake of that coming out. White Men Can't Jump. Uh, Jack Harlow. Uh, uh. I'll stick that on the edit. <laughs> Hello, how are you? I'm good, thank you. How are you? I'm good, thank you. What are you editing? I'm editing the Bobby was a friends. Ooh, look at that busy Sticking. timeline. Yeah. It's like you know what you're doing. Yeah, man. Life of an editor, mate. Life of an editor. Sat in a chair. It's a sad life. <laughs> Do you want to see something cool? Yep. So you want to double click this and you want to zoom into Sam's face, right? Yeah. And then you want to get your rotoscope. So can you talk a bit louder? Please? So then you want to get your rotoscope, right? Yep. So then you highlight around his face. Yeah, that's like right, this, right? So you want to make sure it's all accurate. So you just want to go, you want to hold out to get rid of all of these other little bits, yep. right? So that's, it's not too too shabby if yeah, you're that's, doing a rough little a thing. Very rough. Right, job, so you go right to the end and it will just rotoscope it all for you from frame one to whatever the end frame is. So that's done. So you watch your back and you see. That's pretty much where it's got his face, right? Yeah, that's really rough. So you see how it's just his face, right? Yeah. So you've got this. You want to delete the bottom layer, which is the background. So then that, that one's separate to that one, right? Okay. So let's put this at best rather than standard, so it has a better opportunity of doing it. Say we do uh, hue and saturation, right? Yeah. Once once the uh, effects and presets load is. This could be right, really quick. So hue and saturation, right? So you click that right there. Change the saturation of his face. Oh. I want to make him... Thank you very much. I'm going to make you red. Like that. Like that. Oh, he looks really... So he's really angry, right? Really angry. So now when that moves, that should really move with his body. Yeah. So, look, so we're going to wait 20 frames and then we'll see what happens. But have you taken the colour grade into consideration? I haven't yet. With because, the saturation? No, because we're going to overdo it for now. Okay. So let's do the feather, right? So I want to do about 12, make it a bit more smooth around the edges. Yeah. So you see now it doesn't look as dirty around the edges. Whereas if it was five, it looks a bit rough, it looks a bit yep. cut. His, um, so the uh, feather's just uh, smoothing it off. So now he looks like the guy from Doctor Who. Redhead. Yes. And he looked like um, Doja Cat. Have you seen Doja Cat's thing? Darth Maul. Nah, different person. Oh, not. Oh, well, that yeah, that worked. Not actually redhead. Red man. Red man head. This is the Donnie. That's him. Yeah. So now Sam looks like this guy. It's Darth Maul. See that guy there? Yeah. Now you look at Doja Cat, right? Uh, red. Whoa. This is Doja Cat. Whoa, that is mental. Mad, isn't it? What's she doing? All I need to do now is put diamonds in his face. Doja Sam. Doja Sam, yeah. Thank you for joining my editing tutorial. Please like, comment and subscribe. Peace. That was really satisfying. We hit ring on ring. Uh, that was really cute. Happy Valentine's Day. Happy Valentine's Day. Bow, bow, bow. What, Sam? You good, bro? What are you doing today? Picture out, mapping out the kitchen. Uh, ready for the sparks. The spark is in on Monday. Yeah. Um, and then we've got to rip down the ceiling in the old kitchen, because this is going to be the new kitchen. Um, and Barney, if you go and check out what Barney's been doing, he's got the boiler mounted on the wall. Yeah, he's there, though. Huh? He's not there, he's gonna do a chip shop. Oh, he's gonna do the chip shop. He's not there. He's gonna chip shop? Yeah, you can go and see his work, though. Hello, Bradley. Bonjour, mate. How are you? I'm all right, mate. You seem a little out. bit stressed. I am thinking. Oh, okay. Get this Occupied. wrong. Occupied. Get this wrong and you're bothered. Come here, I'll show you what I've been doing in here. Look, I've been mapping out in here. Right, so we've mapped out in here today. So, told you many a times, but this is my utility room. So I mapped out my downlighters for this section. Here, see that red line there and that red line there? Mm -hmm. That's going to be a boot room, a boot area. So light downlighters in it, so you sit down on a bench. Do you know what I mean? Coat mm -hmm. looks up there, etc., etc. So we've done that. We're going to pull this ceiling down in a minute. They put like chipboard on top of old lava and plaster. So I'm just going to take the chipboard down and hopefully leave the lava and plaster up and then we're going to screw overboard lava and plaster. Oh, mate. Oh, that is messy. That's old school, isn't it? That yeah, lava and plaster's old, but it's just a mess. So we're just going to overboard oh. that, overboard that, overboard that in there. And then I've got to map this out. This. 
big bad boy tank. That's going in this room. There's my boiler on the wall. So I've got my nice new shiny boiler on the wall, all my new pipe work, and Barnes just sorting it out now. Get a new fuse ball, that's getting dropped down lower, and then there's gonna be a stud wall here, all the way up to the ceiling, here to here. And there's gonna be a set of doors there, you walk in there, turn the light on, and you're in the plant room. So then from here, we're gonna have a washing machine, high level, washing machine again, and a tumble dryer. And then draw, pull out drawers, so I put our washing baskets on and whatever else, all the washing facilities and stuff. So that's why we've got the sockets there. And then we're gonna have another socket here, that's a mistake. There's gonna be a full unit here, where you're gonna put your ironing board in there and your hoover. Bang. And then across there, all the way across here, it's gonna carry on as it is now. Worktops, socket, socket, sink in the middle, butler style sink in the middle of that uh, window. And that's my utility room, basically. And then we're gonna level this floor up. And then that door's getting knocked out into the, ex that's like an extension area for utility room. Sorted this out as well, slight switch here for the bar shower room, fan. So that'd be a double switch there, one for the down lights and the ceiling, and one for the wall lights. So what we've got here is a wall light here, and a wall light here with a mirror in the middle, and then a basin down here, so it's symmetrical. And then that's my shower area, from there to there, 1400. That gets tiled, shower on the floor, glass along here, glass along here, shower comes up on this wall. Look nice, fan up there, going on the outside of the wall, coving all the way around, and then we've got six down lighters, one, two, three, four, five, and I've got to mark the sixth one now, sounds moved the light, and then the toilet goes in, WC, in between that gap there. So you're gonna have a nice gap there. Let's sit down and have a shit, bosh. And then I'm keeping that in, because that old floor standing boiler's coming out once Barney's fired up. I'm gonna keep this feet out in, instead of knocking it back, I quite like it, and we're gonna continue this wall across here, and then continue this shelf across here, and then that'll be a nice little bit of white marble up there, as a shelf, and then we'll put flowers up there and whatever else. And we're mapping the kitchen out now. That gap there is an island. That's gonna be a hob with a pop-up extractor fan. Sockets each side of the island, so you're sitting here, you're cooking. TV's over there. Sink unit here, you see the taps coming up? So the pipes. This comes out, obviously. Sorry, can I just moan at cow, cow yeah, bro? Stop no, hold up, mate. So yeah, that's that there. Dishwasher, dishwasher, butt the sink in the middle. And then these windows are gonna like bifold back. So that'd be nice. Still tapping like a sausage, look. And then here is, we're gonna have a fridge, a freezer, high level oven up here, high level oven up there, and they fold out and they push back in. Units above, units below, and whatever else. And then what I like about this here, this is going to be a walk-in larder unit, and they open outwards, and then all your food goes in that larder unit. It's nice. It's just one big cupboard tall. then for all. Yeah, tall. Floor, floor to see whatever is two point two. I can't remember the height. And then you open them up like that, so everything's in there. Space and, upwards. And when you've got big families, all your food's in your fridge and your freezers. They're going to be a separate fridge, tall fridge, separate tall freezer, and then a big walk-in larder. And then a bit of worktop space there. It's a big house, but it ain't a massive kitchen. And your island right here. Island right here, 1.6. Quite a big island, island isn't it? Well, well it's, it's not. It's 1.6 by 1.2, but the hob itself um, are about 800, 850. So it gives me a couple of 300 mil each side, roughly, thereabouts. It ain't a lot, because then we're going to have two lights coming down here on top of the island. And then round here, I've got to map it out now, all down like it's all round here. Quite stressful. Sounded it's, good, but you got it all in your nut. It's in that's your nut, one, but that's one thing you'll get at you. Visualise. You can visualise. Visualise it, so you just got to map it out and you just got to know where it's all going. So I haven't got a final set of drawings either, because I don't know who I'm using for the kitchen yet. So I'm sort of exactly that. So now I'm working it out where it's going, 600 for that, 600 for that, 600 for that, 600 for that. Give or take, because then you've got end fillers. You've got filler panels going in. So these lines ain't bang on, but they're good enough for the electrician. What to think about, you know, when you're planning, when you're doing this, when you're doing an house up, it's not just coming in here, yeah, a bit of pain. It's not bad at the right time, is it? Mm. Because if you put one person first, and the other person should have gone in front, yes. <laughs> <laughs> and that's the truth, though. So the Barney's been here already, that's why his pipes are there ready for the sink. And he's got his pipes already over there for two radios. They're all in place. All the pipes are done, they're all run where they need to be. He's good, that Barney. He's, he's, yeah, he's a perfectionist, mate. He's brilliant, it's neat.
Coffee? No, that's a cold one. I don't think it's cold. Are you listening to any music today, Unc? No, I can't be bothered. Oh. No, I haven't, no, I haven't bothered today because it's too... You in a strop? No, it's too windy up there. I didn't want to... No, so, no, I'm not in a strop. <laughs> you, you'd know if I was. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we shall. Is it Wednesday, look? What was that? We looked at this cup. Having a wall level tournament, what are you saying? Come on. It's all right, isn't it? Right. Worth day off, isn't it? Respect for that one. Well done. So what, what do they win? It's a little six-side tournament. Yep. Put together, so no, they did really well. And one on the to the final and one on penalties. Bang hard, on. Hard, but... Right, so you run that too, yeah? Yeah. Oh, well done. Well done. What's that? I just found the Mike Kawavo I'm on the right. The Mike Kawavo? The Mike Kawavo. Oh, okay. It sits on a it sits in a unit at high level. I'll oh, you, you found the actual one. I'll show you something similar. Something similar to that. Oh, so the Mike Kawavo cool. sits underneath a unit. That's what that that a posh way, or was that actually? Microwave calf, yeah. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Is that all I Oh, sweet. And the kids can't get to it. Kids can't get to it. Do you know my, my Ted, he's 16 nearly this year. When he was two, he stuck my BMW key in the microwave, turned it on, caught a light, bruv. Blew up the key. Unbelievable, wow. that kid. Lucky to see we're really. So whilst Ethan and Barney enjoy their fish and chips, me and Sam, we encounter a major problem. It's solid. Yeah. So where that, where that dip is? Yeah, there, right there. It's clean filled up. Must well, take it down then, mate. We might have to take that lava and plaster down. Oh, mate. Oh, that is messy. That's a stressed face. That is messy, boy. That's the worst that could have been. That was flat. It's not. It's fucked. Where's the um? Oh, I'll leave off. We're gonna have to get some sheets out. We're gonna have to go. We're gonna have to go to get a sheet. I need some dushes anyway. We're gonna have to sheet up that now and sheet all that shit up properly. Put a and plaster. It's mission, that is. Oh, soundy. It is, man. It's a full blade. That's a big mission, that is. Are you leaving my boy everywhere? He's like a borer on. So he's borrowed through. <laughs> like a borrower. What are you showing me, Sam? So, we was only going to remove this, the hardboard, yeah? Mm -hmm. But this is called lard and plaster. So it's easy to lard. The dusting is anything, right? They collect dust and that's obviously your plaster. We was going to board over this with just plasterboard, but we're going to have to take all of that lard and plaster down now, which is horribly messy and dusty because this here bows. So when you board it, if you was going to board over it, your ceiling would be bowed because obviously you're only going to what that is. So now we're going to have to flatten that because that goes like that. Goes like that. It's a big belly in it. A bit like my belly, but a bit smaller. That goes. He looks like exactly the same as him. He does, doesn't he? Yeah. Good jeans. Yeah. Well, what do you, what do you think he's going to look like? Well, him. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Basically, Ian is our accountant, and our accountant, Ian's son, Atticus, Atticus Blue on Instagram, he is doing a gig, his first headline gig. He's just been signed, I believe, to a record company. Um, he's doing a gig in Hackney. So me, Ethan, and Sam um, are going to watch it. Oh, and maybe Calvin. <laughs> oh, but I held... <laughs> Why do you not even You are me? so easy to wind up. What, you're going to invite me? Yes, of course I was going to invite you. No, you wasn't. You actually yeah. wasn't. Yeah, mate, you used to invite me. <laughs> Calv, I have ne I've never been to a live gig like that. Oh, Calv, do you want to come, mate? Then Ethan and Sam turn up. Oh, Ethan and Sam, come on. Yeah, because they're, they're like men. They're more Going cool. out with you is like going out with a bird. Bird. <laughs> He's, hey. he's distracting me. I'm Come on, Cal. I'm, I'm hey, you're joking. Joking. Come on, bro. Me and Calv carry on with the utility room. Brad calls the Sparky to confirm some measurements. Dave Spark Shaggy's on my phone. Because it wasn't me, he says. Listen to him. What, what, boy, George? Scooby, 
<laughs> Shaggy, what's that name? <laughs> That's all right. I would just see if you'd about anyone. Sit top man, sit close to it tomorrow morning, but I'll come tomorrow morning. That's all right, bro. All right, yeah, I'm here all day anyway, but yeah, tomorrow morning's good. Yeah. While well, I got you on the phone before you shoot off, Dave, I'm mapping out some downlighters in the kitchen area. Yeah. You know, give me an idea. You know, the base units are 600 deep and the wall units yeah. are 300. Yeah. How far off the wall do you normally map your downlighters? We talk about seven, eight hundred, because you don't want it too near, but you don't want to get a shadow either. I've done eight hundred, that's what I thought. I thought yeah, it was I that. Think, I like to think you're doing that under cover lights. The under cover lights now, they're so good. I, I, I ain't got much under I, I ain't got much wall unit. I've only got a little two metre stretch of that, so I'm definitely oh, yeah, so, but you, you want a minimum eight hundred if you don't Eight hundred. Yeah. yeah. Well done, mate, that's what I've done. Yeah, yeah. And remember, you don't with me. LEDs now, though, you don't go overkill. You don't need to go overkill. Yeah, what, with the amount of lights in, you mean? The amount of lights, yeah. I mean, you can always put a dimmer. Yeah. Aeroplanes now, deny it at the same time, do you, bro? Do you yeah, 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 yeah. No, 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 I'm yeah. with you. All right, guys, Christy. Christy. Oh, Love you lots. See you soon. Time, mate. 800, that's what I did. Not there, I didn't, but here's 800. That is 800 off the wall. From there to there is 800. It's that shadow point. Here, do 800 again, then. We'll come out of 800, so that'd be in line here. So 800. 800 is there, my old chopper. So now what we've got to do is make this look pretty. So we're going to divide this up. We're going to come in 300 mil from the edge by 800. There's our first light. We'll do the same that end, and then we we'll split it. Would be a lot. We're well, free. Right we're free. Yeah. We're free. So that's the one. That one's dead. You got your rubber. That's dead. And we'll go for that middle one. And that's that. There you go. One, two, three. One, two, three. You know what? I reckon I can do away with two of them bastards and all. I think that's too many. If I scribble it out, he can tell me if it's too many. That one can go. We keep that one. We miss one. We keep that one. We miss one. We keep that one. So we've got one, two, three. And old Shaggy will tell me if he fancies another one. Doing well, Sam. See why we didn't want to do this now. <laughs> Let's see how it goes. Oh, that is nice. Go there, mate. Yeah, mate, fine. What are you doing? Nothing to see here. No, I think I did just see something. An hole in the bucket. Why have you got a hole in your bucket? It's like one mine, it was yours. <laughs> Been trashed by all the builders. <laughs> You're lucky I didn't have my camera. Yeah, that was a sight to see. You're lucky I didn't have my camera in my hand. Uh, mate. Sign of a good plumber, mate. Makes everything wet. There's some evidence that shows otherwise. Well, it was her. Sitting in, I was off. So my legs started getting wet, what's <laughs> that? Thank you, boy! Hello, mate! How are you? You alright? Yeah. Where you been? Uh, Shops. Shops? Yeah. What'd you we get? were going to go out of bounds, but we can't because it's too busy. Out of bounds? Yeah. What's out of bounds? Do you know what out of bounds is? No, is it? Say, so she doesn't know what out of bounds is! Huh? He doesn't know what out of bounds is! Do you know where next is? London. Soft play. Do you know where Ossington is? Yeah. It's there. It's soft play. Yeah, but what is it? Soft, soft, soft play. It's got soft oh. play, bowling, climbing, what? jumping, yours. golf, and in and in and there's um, place next to it. There's swimming and there's also football. Yeah. Um, what? In there. That sounds good. You know, boss. <laughs> <laughs> Bit of a surprise, isn't it? You should have stayed out. You should have stayed out. 
Ten more minutes, you would have never enough. Yeah, you should have waited ten I'm minutes. Right <laughs> I'm back out. I'm <laughs> meant to be doing part work here and I've got a broom in here. I'm like a sparky, I like. Yeah, that's it. It's the most important thing to cover up, eh? It's now time to see me old mate's invention. Ah, these guys are bald. So uh, these these guys bald. So <laughs> they, uh, they basically mark half traves when it comes to margin gaps. So it's, it's quite simple to do. So you try it. I'll put my coffee down. Yeah. As well. So basically, on the back, you've got a rebate out. So you've got three different sizes. You've got five mil, seven mil, nine mil. So you've got fire doors. They've got a bigger front the hinges. Mm -hmm. You put a bigger gap around it. And on the other side as well, you've got two little sections so you can mark out a three inch butt or a four inch butt. And bait, let's say you're going to put architrave up here, it's not very good to do it, but you put it up in the corner, literally, just mark away, all the way down, you're good to go. Or if you want to say mark out a hinge on a frame, it's not difficult to do, but let's say here, for example, you're going to cut a new hinge in, you can actually you know, put it on the side like that and mark out your four inch inch or three inch, depending on which one you want. So, That's handy. And they obviously pre-hung doors you get on site, you can you get them behind it already, so nice and easy to do. So, pop on mate, you need them, come get them. Didn't have the money to get the uh, tool injection made, then got enough money to do that. And then we used them, didn't we? We had black ones for years and then no one was interested and then went to the tool fair show in London, Ali Pali, and they just went off. Oh, it's really? like a rocket, yeah. Literally, everyone was like, "Oh, what do I? I don't need that." And then actually saw it and like, "Oh, mate, let's have one." So literally, yeah, sold 150, 200. So it's brilliant. Jeez. Yeah, smashed the day. Yeah, it's a great feeling that night to know that something that I've done for yes. five years it or it works. Where can people get them for as well? They can get them on, so they can buy them direct from the Artmark website. Here yeah, tools. Sterling's, Sterling Power Tools. Sterling Center. Yeah, they're on the shelf. We're trying to get a mainstream. -y. We've reached out to Wix Tool Station. That's what we're trying to get them. Yeah, mm. it'd be good. The yeah, be the one. That'd be sick. <laughs> That'd be sick. Howden's would be good as well. Yeah, Howden's be good. Well. All of them, innit? Yeah. For us, like we think it's always good to go around. We're always having the same margin, no matter what. You yeah, know, consistency is key. Nice. And you'll remember the colour, won't you? Yeah. If you've done that on the ground floor, all the time, you'll you know it's red. Yeah, it's good shout. Yeah. Do you know what? The most basic is thing as well, isn't it? But they're always the thing, all the inventions. Mm. No, when I remember watching Cocktails with Tom, uh, Tom Cruise, you know the film Top Cow? Top, uh, Cocktails. He talked about the umbrellas that go into a mixer. What are they called? You know the little umbrellas, the douche umbrellas, yeah, 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 the paper yeah. ones? Yeah. Someone's a multi-millionaire from making them little paper umbrellas. There's a kid that invented the um, biodegradable golf tee as well. Yes. Biodegradable golf tee. Invented biodegradable golf tee. Yeah. Golf tea. Invented that, multi-millionaire. People need to know it's there. That's all it is. Yeah. Well, Tool Station have got 550 odd branches. Imagine they stock them in Tool Station yeah. and everyone goes in every day and buys one. Yeah, yeah, it's crazy. That's all it is, isn't it? Yeah. It's like, it's that whole penny thing, isn't it? Save a penny and you'll be a millionaire one day. It's that sort of idea. Yeah. Whilst the boys are doing a lovely job in cleaning up the gaff, my kids, they're up to no good again. The next door just pulled up. I just asked what does that guy hit up? Van the other week, and I gave her the details of the driver. Yeah. So I just said to her, oh, excuse me, oh, to get it sorted. So you said, Kelvin wants to kiss you. You're his new girlfriend. And I was like, oh. then Frank was like, yeah, he wants to get off with you. <laughs> she was like, she goes, no, I'm too old for him. And then Frank goes, oh, is it because he's ugly? You just sound funny. Can you come with me? That's so funny. <laughs> I can't! <laughs> oh. <laughs> can't take anything off the gear. Are you back now, boss? Yeah, I'm going again. Are you going? Not done yet. Ah, uh, she's still got loads of room there. That's a brand new hat, isn't it? <laughs> yeah. Literally on today? Uh, this morning. Oh. Do you know what they're doing? They're going to my neighbour over there, Caroline. Stop it. No, they. Stop it. I've heard them. Why I can't be a parent because I can't deal with stuff like that. <laughs> <laughs> it's made it off. Yeah, he comes up. Mate, you should when he came oh, back yeah. around the oh, yeah. corner. Oh, I know because they're relentless, isn't they? Because they don't stop. Yeah. Well, I squashed it and they carried on. You okay down there, Sam? Found the treasure yet? Yeah? Doing a very good job. 
Not yet, mate. I swear that it said there on the, um, on the treasure it was, map. It was X marks the spot. It was, yeah, yeah. Spoiler, <laughs> look out. must have moved it. No, I'm not staying. You're horrible. We are get me back. Santa's car. <laughs> Chicken. You're horrible today. You're getting uglier, Robert Perry. Thanks, Ethan. You look more like a microphone today than you did yesterday. Oh, what's up? All right, mate. What are you doing there? I'm doing a little bit of timber work in the downstairs shower room. I'll show you. Building a little stuff, I told you, innit? Building a stud wall. I told you earlier, do you know what I mean, Brad? You told me earlier, but I thought I'd check in. Check in. With the camera, as it is my job. Oh. We've got another day here tomorrow, me and Sam. We've got to de nail the rest of this, take the rest of these lava off tomorrow. And then we're going to build ourselves a stud wall around about here, all the way up. Out the rear. We'll do that tomorrow. Hello, Sam. Oh, boy. Dust everywhere. Don't stop. Where's the You're going to have a sore throat tomorrow. That's a problem, huh? You're going to have a sore throat tomorrow. Do what? Used to it, mate. No, solid, mate. didn't you? Stop laughing. Oh, you are solid. I don't know why Pe it's for no reason, bruv. People uh, underestimate you. I wouldn't want to fight you, actually. I reckon you got a mean punch. We should do uh, one of them... Punch bags? Yeah. Not though. The things that come down. Yeah, you punch it. <laughs> yeah, like punch machines. You see that? Yeah. <laughs> I'm a lover, not a fighter. Why don't you ever cut them square? That's because I was holding... Uh, it's where the timber weren't holding straight. Same, same. Oh, same oh hello. Is like that your nose? Yeah, boy. No. That's why you got to wear masks, people. That is why you should wear masks. That's and amazing. warn people that you're pulling the ceiling down when they're still underneath. <laughs> Barney said to me, just do what you got to do, mate. I know I'm a plumber, but I'm not that type of plumber. You I'm not needy. Just, just do what you want. Kid Barney's. Hello. Oh, yeah. Don't say that. My Kid Barney's. Okay, this was conceived a long time before Barney started in his house. Oh, well, he was just saying, he was around in December. His baby was October. Oh, yeah. Wow. Are you done as well now? Yeah, it's Friday, it's four o'clock. Oh, you're half day as well. I am actually half day. I got this morning. <laughs> oh, he's proper half day. <laughs> I had to go to the old uh, clinic. mental institution. Not the clinic, don't say that. <laughs> <laughs> I got it back. <laughs> <laughs> it's the thing I got the old jab back, <laughs> wasn't I? <laughs> <laughs> Scratching's gone now, though, right? so it's all right. <laughs> Luckily, the swelling's still there, though. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> yeah, it's bad. <laughs> right, Cal? Yeah, I've done actually no harm, haven't I? You just wanted to get away from the kids for a minute, didn't you? <laughs> Seeing him look at you. That's because you told him I was gay. <laughs> <laughs> Tuesdays, he might have a bit of luck. <laughs> Ready? Thank you, good luck. Oh! Wait, 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 no! That was Let close. Get the ball. Yeah, go on. Oh! oh! Thank you, good night! <laughs> You've been done. Man, don't do that! Have on. Have a lovely weekend. Thank you, Andrew. See you uh, next week. Maybe. Maybe. Oh, yes. What a shot. No, that was past me. Oh, 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 Frank, come on. In close. Oi. Sam, oh, first try. Oh, 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 yeah. Oh. oh, 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 
That's me down for a day Eve. I'm gonna measure up what I need for tomorrow. So got a built, little frame, chuck it up. Bang, this continues through here now, you can see now, can't you? So that continues through there. Yeah. And then this continues through there, and then that'll be a nice bit of marble top. So that will be plasterboard. We're blocking half that up actually, because the sink's there. So I want that blocked up so it looks nice. And then shelves. And then that'll be boarded. I'm just using the off cuts, if you wonder why it's like that. I've just thrown them in there because there was off bits and I needed to pick that ball. Just pour a ball covered in there. We'll have to put another bit in there actually as well, otherwise that board will just flop around. End of the week for, for Yuri for the end of the week. Hey, you right, mate? You're on the operation day, why up? Yeah! <laughs> 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 it's a mess because you left it. <laughs> Get lungs. <laughs> Sandwich I left it a mess. Right, see what was up there. Excuse me, that's a bit dangerous like that, isn't it? Do you want me to put a sticker saying my bread? I'll sort it. <laughs> I'll sort it now, Ren. Someone's got to sort it. Thanks for watching the Ball Builders. Like and subscribe, and we'll see you all next time. Bye bye. <laughs>